back to our YouTube channel. In today's video, we will see how to fix our servers can't process your request at this time. Please try again on EA College Football 25. So the solution one is create a new blank lineup. So start EA College Football 25 and navigate to the main menu. Then select the option for lineup or rosters and look for the option that allow you to switch or manage your lineup and then click on switch lineup. Then after select the option to create a new lineup and then choose the create a blank lineup instead of copying an existing one. Manually add player to each position in the lineup. Make sure to include all position include backup. Ensure that every position is filled including less common ones like backup fullback. After filling in all position save your new lineup. Go back to the main menu and try to access the solo challenge or the game mode that was previously giving you the error and check if the issue persists. The solution to is check EA College Football 25 server status. You can simply go to the EA website to verify if the server for College 25 are operationally. If the servers are undergoing maintain wait until they are back online. Solution 3. Restart EA College Football 25 and your console. For PlayStation 5, press the PlayStation button on your controller to go to the home screen. And highlight EA College 25, press the option button. And then select close game and then press and hold the power button on the front of the console until it beep twice and turn off completely. And then unplug the power cord from the back of the console and wait for about 30 seconds. And then plug the power cord back in and press the power button to turn on the console. Once the console is powered on, navigate to EA College Football 25 and launch the game again. For Xbox series, press the Xbox button on your controller to open the guide. And then navigate to My Games and App and select See All Find EA College Football 25 and press the menu button, then select Quit. And press and hold the power button on the front of the console until it turns off completely. Unplug the power supply from the wall outlet and wait for about 10 seconds. And then plug the power supply back in and press the power button to turn on the console. Once the console is powered on, navigate to the EA College Football 25 and launch the game again. Fix 4. Uninstall and reinstall EA College Football 25. For PlayStation 5, from the home screen, scroll to the EA College Football 25 icon and press the option button on the game title and then select delete to uninstall the game and then go to PlayStation Store and search for EA College Football 25 and select download to reinstall the game. After installation, go back to the home screen and start EA College Football 25. For Xbox Series users, from the home screen, you can simply go to My Game and App and highlight EA College Football 25 and press the menu button and select manage game and add on. Choose uninstall to remove the game and go to the Microsoft store and search for EA College Football 25 and select uninstall to reinstall the game. After installation go back to the my games and app and start EA College Football 25. Fix 5. Contact EA support. Go to the EA support website and search for your specific issue. If the problem persists, submit a support ticket for personalized assistant. And that's it. So if you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more tech tips and tutorial. Goodbye.